Good morning everybody, welcome here to another video. Um, I decided to pick up my camera this weekend and basically vlog for you whatever whatever happens in my life, I will vlog it. So yeah, it's going to be a little bit of a random video over the next four days because I'm off for four days. Um, today is Friday and I should be in work and I'm not and I'm loving every single second of it. I've only gotten up, I literally put some quick makeup on. I haven't done my hair yet because I'm doing my hair later on. Um, but I have a meeting at nine on Zoom. So I'm going to take my laptop and head downstairs, make a coffee and have the meeting first. Right, so I'm all ready for my meeting. I made myself a gigantic cup of coffee that I can hopefully enjoy whilst we chat. Um, as I previously mentioned, I took a day off today from work because I still have so many holiday days left because we didn't go on holidays this year. Um, and yeah, I just decided to take a random Friday off so I can have a long weekend then on Monday I have a couple of things going on as well, so I just decided to take Monday off too. So, with that, with that said, I don't really have any plans for today that are happening like right now. This meeting at 9 and then I was supposed to go and see my friend, but her kids are sick right now. So I just, I don't know whether we're doing something or whether it's off. I'm not totally sure yet. Um, but that's fine because I'm not doing anything today anyways, um, well, until the evening, so it doesn't matter whether I do something or I don't, it's not like it's ruining any plans. Um, in the evening I'm heading out for dinner, so I might do a little get ready with me, um, for that, because I'm actually very excited to go out for dinner, and I saw that they have cornstar martinis on the menu. And I'm very excited. I haven't had one of those in forever. Um, so yeah, I'm excited to have some cocktails. But for now, I'm having this meeting about a potential collab um, for Instagram, I believe. Maybe TikTok as well, I'm not sure. Um, but yeah, just gonna have this. Um, it says only 15 minutes. So after that, I need to put on a wash. Um, and have some breakfast because I didn't have um, very much time before this. Do you know what? It was so funny. I said it to Aaron already. Um, usually I get up at half six and I'm not a morning person whatsoever. Um, like don't talk to me until I wake up. <laughs> um, and yeah, I woke up um, at eight this morning, which is like usually the time I should be in work at. And I just could knock it up. Like, I should be in work. Why am I still sleeping? Like, but yeah, absolutely wrecked. Um, hopefully this coffee can help. Um, but yeah, five minutes till the meeting. I believe there is a parcel from Dunn's coming over to me today, 
which is very exciting. Um, what did I order? I ordered some um, matching Christmas pajamas for Erin and I, and I can't wait to see them. Um, I'm not sure what else I got ordered. I think it was like a couple of presents or something like that. Because we've started Christmas shopping. I know. Thir it, literally, when was it? Twelfth? I think we went on the 11th. The 11th of October is when I started. Um, I ordered some things online. We went to Kildare Village. Um, bought a couple of things there. So yeah, I'm very... Um, happy that I did that and I started. Let me know when you start um, your Christmas shopping. Now, Aaron usually does his on like the 22nd, 23rd. So this year I said, because there's two of us now shopping as a couple for people, um, it, it all changes. You're gonna be shopping when I'm shopping and I shop really early. Um, so yeah, um, got a couple of bits, still lots to get. Um, I'm still kind of like, what do I get for some people? But we'll get there, no pressure, it's literally October. Um, I also wanna have a look at certain things in the Black Friday sales because that's always really good and you get so many good deals. Actually, speaking of good deals, I got the Cosmotips box um, the other day. Oh my gosh, Cosmotips and Molly May so so good she always comes out with such amazing edits and i've always wanted one but like i feel like they always come out at a certain point i think they always come out in a, in and around october correct me if i'm wrong and every time it came out i like didn't have money or i was going somewhere and i couldn't spend money so this time i set my alarm and actually the products in this one were the best yet they were so so good um, so yeah, I am very, very excited. Um, certain things in there I've already tried and I love. So yeah, very excited. Such a bargain. Um, so yeah, very excited. And I'm gonna show you probably, I'll do like an unboxing or something um, in one of my next videos. I don't know when it's coming. I saw that some of the people from the UK already got theirs, but I'm in Ireland. So it said, I think five to 10 working days. So it might not come till like the end of next week or something, so. It'll have to be for the next vlog, but I better start rambling. I have three minutes till this meeting. I need to read the email again just to familiar, familiar, familiarize, is that the word? Uh, myself with what we're going to be chatting about because at the moment I'm clueless. I'm more into my coffee than I am into this meeting. Ah! The panic, the sheer panic right now. It is time to get up from this spot. I still didn't have breakfast and I'm tempted to maybe skip it. No, I can't. I need to have breakfast. Um, I also really wanna pack my bag because we're staying over at Aaron's mom's house tonight um, because we're gonna be having some cocktails. So then we can't drive home, um, but I need to pack a bag and I don't know what to wear tomorrow. Probably just my comfies. Like today, I have black leggings on. These leggings, they're the contour leggings from Dunn's. If you haven't gotten a pair of these yet, I don't know what you're doing. They also have my favorite flared leggings. So the contour flared leggings, get them too. Perfect. The best, I think it's 15 euro. I think the leggings are 15 euro and I think the flared ones are 20. Best money you'll ever spend. Trust me. I feel like I have six pairs or seven pairs, something like that. Something crazy like that. I think six um, of the leggings and I only have one pair of the flare trousers. And when they're in the wash, actually speaking of the wash, they're in the wash basket now. Um, when they're in the wash, I'm not a happy bunny because I want to wear them again. So I'm actually gonna put them on now together with all the other things and get this going whilst I'm still at home. I don't know what I'm doing as I told you already, but get a wash going at least. I'm aware you can't see me, but 
I also don't know what to wear this evening. Um, it's not like a dressy dressy dinner, but it's also not like casual. So I feel like dressy casual <laughs> would be perfect. Um, I'm thinking my wide leg Zara jeans again. I have just been obsessed with them. I don't wear them during the week. I don't tend to get dressed up for work at all. I go like this or in a jumper. Um, and every time it's the weekend and I wanna go somewhere, I wanna wear those jeans. So I feel like I'm gonna wear them. Probably my black little kitten heels because they go really well with the jeans. But as for the top, I have no idea. So we're gonna have to go up to my wardrobe and have a look. I'm just in the car and I'm on my way to my friend's house. Where, I'm sorry if you can hear that noise, I have the like can of de-icer in the door there, in the passenger door. And it's making so much noise. I usually have it in the boot, obviously, but the other morning, was it like yesterday? Yeah, yesterday on the way to work, um, I left the house and the front windscreen was like thick in ice. Um, the de-icer didn't even help. So I had to put it in my door here, just in case I need it again. But I might have to put it back because the noise is annoying. Um, but yeah, I'm heading to my friend's house. Um, we're just gonna spend a couple of hours together. Um, I want to do her nails because I do my buy up anyways on myself and I said I'd do her nails. Um, I think we're going to first head out and grab a little Starbucks drive through and then head to the playground before it starts raining because um, yeah, one of our kids can have a little run around and um, basically play on the playground whilst we sip on our coffee. Um, yeah, I think it's supposed to rain today, which is not ideal. Um, I feel like whenever we plan something, it always rains, but it is what it is. I'm grateful that I have a day off, and whatever weather comes with it, I don't mind, as long as I'm off work. <laughs> um, but yeah, I'm gonna go and do that. I probably won't vlog much, um, just because I don't want to invade anybody's privacy but if she wants to be in the vlog she can be in the vlog um but yeah she was actually in my vlog uh she was actually in my videos before so if you're an og subscriber you would have seen sophie in my videos she also had a youtube channel herself um which she needs to pick up so sophie if you're watching get on the youtube please thank you very much um but anyways i'm gonna go it's nine degrees ah! autumn's here autumn's here and i'm so excited i'm wearing my oaks as well for the first time this year like the proper oaks not the tasmans um the proper ones so i'm feeling very cozy and um, i should have done my hair i'm kind of annoyed at myself that i didn't do anything with my hair and i hate these little bits in the front that just curl but it is what it is i'm gonna have to do my hair later um anyways so i wasn't getting dirty I'll probably get rained on and all, so it doesn't matter. Anyways, I'm gonna stop rambling. Let's go. I'm excited for a Starbucks as well, so. You know me, I'm a sucker for a Starbucks. I feel like I have a Starbucks in hand every time you see me, every time I post or have a video. But I don't technically go that often. I go maybe once every two, three weeks. Sometimes I only go like once a month, so. I feel like it just looks like I go all the time in my pictures, but it's not really. Anyways, goodbye. <laughs> We got Starbucks. I got the usual caramel syrup. Okay. No, it's okay. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> and what is this called? Coffee cream brownie. Coffee cream brownie. Mm. No, coffee caramel. Oh well, whatever it is, it looks good, right? But yeah, got Starbucks. So we got a pumpkin spice frappuccino. Oh, that's nice. But yeah, we're gonna go to the playground and oh shit. <laughs> yep, yep, that just it's happened. It's okay, we don't care in this car. That will probably slide down. I feel like you need two bites before it really hits. Mmm. Mm-hmm. It's so good. Have you had it before? Nope. 
<laughs> nope. <That's pretty> <laughs> Mmm. Do you know what this tastes like? Tell me. The biscuits. Mmm. Good. Doesn't it? Yeah. I still have them at home. I still haven't finished that box. <laughs> you must have really liked them. <laughs> I do like them. I just don't Looks eat like that it. much. <laughs> <laughs> you got them about 10 years ago. <laughs> They're gone to my house in one day. Mmm. So good. It's really nice. I want you to try the biscuit. Um, Cookie? Sandwich. I don't know like Marta, stop doing that! <laughs> Sorry, I don't know where that went. <laughs> Look at where see. you were sitting. You were sitting in crumbs and leaves and dirt. That's no. Fine. You're sitting in a well loved child car. Yeah. Okay. Alright, let's go. Oh no. Oh. Well, That's not for babies. It's the usual thing. Say that hi! The kids do, right? <gasps> Can you blow the camera a kiss? No. <gasps> Martha's turn. Woohoo! Oh, Martha, go! What's she doing? <laughs> What's she doing, Martha? <laughs> you coming up here? What one is that one? Well, I forgot to vlog whilst getting ready, but I'm ready now. I kind of like curled my hair a little bit with my straightener, but it's all gone now. So I'm probably gonna have to redo it when I get to Aaron's mom's house. But anyways, um, yeah, I'm gonna leave my camera here because I don't think we're gonna do, or maybe I'll bring it with me just in case we do something tomorrow. I don't know. Yeah, I'll bring it with me. But yeah, my outfit is fairly boring. This is it. Jeans, these shoes, and that is it. So, and the blazer, but that's in the other room. So yeah, just this. Let's go. Good morning, everybody. So it is now Sunday. I basically did not vlog a single thing yesterday. Um, We were out on Friday till about one o'clock um, and then just got home and went to sleep. Got up, I think at like, 11 or something like that and went out for breakfast with two of our friends and then came home again then went out for lunch um so yeah it was basically just a day full of chilling and eating <laughs> which is what we do best um but yeah so i didn't do anything saying that we then came home and we um, didn't even have dinner because we had a late lunch and we watched the match um, I was so sad that Ireland lost in the rugby um, match but it is what it is there is nothing we can do um, so yeah so I didn't vlog anything that was a bit pointless um, we were all so tired yesterday so um, but yeah today I'm up I'm not putting any makeup on as of yet because I don't know what our plans are. Aaron's in work. I'm going to basically just head downstairs, have my breakfast and then start on the cleaning because I didn't do the cleaning yesterday. And Aaron was even saying like, oh, just skip it, just do it next week. But no, 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 no. I like my house to be nice and clean and ready for a fresh week tomorrow. But yeah. I need to open a Dunn's parcel, so I might do that with you. Um, we got our Christmas pajamas, and then I also have a, a couple of bits from Pure that I'd like to show you. So I'm just gonna do that now, whilst I'm sitting here, and I hope you don't mind me doing that. So the first thing is Dunn's, and I'm not totally sure why they put everything in like separate boxes but I believe this is like a Christmas dish a plate that basically has a little Christmas tree on it Christmas trees on it wow such a big box for this I hate when they do that oh that is tiny but it's kind of cute so this is it it was five euro now it is tiny look at it compared to my head and I have a big head um, um, but yeah, 
cute for some like biscuits or something like that, cookies um, for the Christmas table. But yeah, as I said, that is a very big box for such a small thing. And next up we have a big order. I got some Christmas socks, Christmas fluffy socks for Aaron. I know he's not gonna watch this vlog. Um, so, because he's always wanting Christmas socks. Crap, these are kids socks. Well, I got socks that are too small. Our pajamas. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Okay, let's see what they look like. This is them. Very cute. Oh, I love them. They're basically like leggings. So that's that. And then this is the top. And yeah, just have matching these. Um, so I thought that would be really cute to have some matching pajamas for Christmas. I saw so many others online, but there was every pair that I saw, I was like, mm, I don't like this about that, and I don't like this about that. So I just went with these. They were super cheap as well. They were only 18 euro, um, which I feel like is cheap compared to some of the other like, prices that I'm seeing online some pajamas are like 60 euro each and I'm like I ain't paying that much money for pajamas that are also Christmas that I can't really wear any other time of the year and um, I then got I then can't show you what else I got because my mom's gonna be watching this and it's a Christmas present so but yeah that's everything that I got from Dunn's now I'm going to show you the PR that I got recently, last week, I believe. So yeah, first up is a parcel from Skin Proud and it is for their face melt um, like super balm. So basically like you can remove your makeup with it and it's perfect for Halloween looks um, that you might be doing right now. I know that loads of the people that I follow are doing um, Halloween makeup looks like almost every single day on Instagram and I'm loving seeing them so I feel like this would be perfect for that. I'm not much of a Halloween girl at all so I won't be doing anything but I'm still very excited to use this and yeah I will let you know what I think. So thank you very much Skin Proud for sending me that. I then got a parcel from Cloud 10 Beauty, my favourites, um, and they were very kind and sent me their new glow, glow Getter box, which is basically a box full of products um, that are like stunning, literally stunning. And the whole box is worth 200 um, euro and it's only 49.95. Now I do believe it's out of stock at the moment, it's sold out. But it's stunning anyways, and I'm going to show you the products that are in it anyways, in case you're looking for some of them. Um, so this is what the box looked like. <clears throat> I shared this on my Instagram as well at the time. Um, but it basically comes with all of these products. How amazing is that? So the first thing, I'm just going to run really quickly through this. The first thing in here is the Pixie Rose Tonic to go. So it's basically the rose tonic, but like in like pre-soaked um, little cotton pads. Um, so I'm very excited to try this because I've, I've um, tried Pixie Tonics before and I really like them. Then we have a Trilogy Cream Cleanser. Um, with rose hip, evening primrose, and carrot. Again, lovely and very excited to try that. Then we have a star skin pink cactus pudding. Um, this is, I think, a moisturizer, but it's a really cool packaging on the inside. How cool is this? And it also comes with a little spoolie. Uh, not spoolie, a little. It also comes with a little. What's it called? spoon to so you can spoon out the cream fab 
Um, so yeah, I've never tried anything from this brand, so I'm excited to give it a go and see how I get on with it. Then we have the Alpha H Beauty Sleep Power Peel. This is very intriguing. Um, I don't tend to use any peels. I've used one from Clear Start from Dermalogica and that's about it. I've never used anything else. This I'm super excited about. It's the First Aid Beauty Eye Duty Niacinamide, that's how you pronounce that word, brightening cream. It's a night cream. I love a night cream. Um, I might actually pop this on right now because I actually, I did my skincare, but I didn't. Oh, it's like brown. What? I did not expect that, if you could tell from my reaction. I never knew that it would be a colored um, product. I feel like I need all the cream. I feel so tired. I also have a banging headache. <laughs> Um, so this might be nice, but yeah, um, next up is the pestle and mortar um, Clarify For all skin types. It's a toner again very excited never tried anything from this brand Then we have the Emma Hardy morning renewal treatment mask this I'm super excited about because I've heard so many good things about Emma Hardy, so very excited and then the last thing is the Ellen Joe 3 in 1 Hyaluronic Skin Mist. Hydrate, plump, and set. This sounds fab. I love Ellen Joe as well. I want to see what this smells like. What? Okay, we're spraying this. This smells stunning. Orange blossom. There we go. I was like, what, what does this smell like? It smells like orange. Do you know what this smells like? It smells a little bit like Terry's chocolate orange. Whoa, that's a big mist. <laughs> it just comes out in like a big spray. What was I supposed to do? The refreshing and soothing facial mist is perfect for restoring moisture levels throughout the day to enhance skin and makeup. With hydrating and skin plumping hyaluronic acid alongside chamomile, cucumber and aloe extracts to soothe and refresh, it is a beauty must have for dehydrated skin types as well as those wanting a dewy healthy glow. Perfect. Okay, I love that. This might be my new favorite product, honestly. Wow, it was super nice. Okay, love it. And yeah, that's everything that was in that box. Again, thank you very much to Cloud10 Beauty for sending me those goodies. I'm very excited to try them out and I will keep you updated as to what I think of them along the way. <laughs> and then last but not least, I was very kindly sent some PR from Polished London. I've followed Polished London for such a long time, what feels like. Um, and this is it. It's for their new Hyaluronic Teeth Whitening Powder, which is fab. Um, it also came with like this newspaper article about it, which is really cool. It's basically like the newspaper. Um, so yeah, that was that. It comes, I have it in the bathroom. I'm gonna have to bring it to the bathroom because this is what the Pure Drop looks like. The product is in there and it comes with two toothbrushes. Aaron was saying, oh, they gave me a toothbrush too. And I was like, yeah, they did. Um, but yeah, it comes in this box, but I have the actual product in the bathroom. Um, but it looks like this. I've used it, um, I think, three times. I'm loving it so far. Makes your teeth feel super, super clean. Um, and yeah, I'm gonna continue using it because I feel like it's really, really good. Um, it also has so many benefits for your um, teeth and gums, so perfect. It is 32 euro and you can buy it on polish.com. So yeah, thank you so much to all of the brands for sending me some of their pure. Very, very grateful as always. Um, and yeah, I feel like we need to go and get on with the day. And I also have to clean up all this mess because...
responsibility. This is a direct frontal assault on my leadership. I'm just finishing up my coffee. I have the headache still and I took a painkiller and everything and it's still not working. I don't know what's going on. Um, but I'm just finishing my coffee and I'm about to start cleaning. Um, we have our friends coming over later on. We're gonna go for a nice autumnal walk, grab a coffee I think and basically just enjoy the, enjoy the sunshine because it's four degrees but it's super sunny so I love this weather. Um, all the leaves are on the ground, sunny. So I'm going to clean, then get myself ready. Um, we still didn't do the food shop so I feel like maybe we'll do that tomorrow. I'm also off tomorrow as I said. So um, yeah, so let's get cracking. Let's get um, to cleaning and hopefully I can get this done without sweating. We also got some light bulbs for our lights out here and we still haven't put them in maybe i can do it myself can i mm, maybe not um these little lights that we have in the sunroom so i'm just gonna pop the light bulbs on later on because i am really looking forward to seeing um what those look like because it's like a light that will go up up and down perfect anyways let's get cleaning cleaning and I also just did my makeup I just did a little bit of um, concealer and my brows and mascara and that is all but I'm just getting my outfit ready for the walk and I need my big fur coat because it is freezing so I'm going to wear this like gilet thing and also one of these one of these jumpers and then just the flare charges that I have on still and I think that might be cute so I'm gonna film a little reel I think I'm gonna film a reel on our walk um, of my little outfit very very um easy and simple outfit so nothing very exciting but yeah I'm <sighs> but yeah I'm just waiting for Aaron to get home so in the meantime I feel like I'm just going to sit down on the sofa and chill for a little while I'm absolutely shattered <laughs> from cleaning the house really fast but it's done now so that's all that matters. But yeah, I'm gonna go and watch some more Gilmore Girls. So here is my little outfit of the day. This is what I'm wearing. Just some, I'm actually wearing some fake Uggs from Dunn Stores because I'm not sure what the walk, um, I'm not sure, I'm actually wearing some, I'm actually wearing some fake Uggs from Duns because I just don't know what the like ground situation will be on, on the walk and I don't want to ruin my real ones so at least with these I can walk on the grass I can walk in the leaves and I don't have to care so that's why I'm wearing these but this is my outfit very cozy very cute and I'm excited for the walk I have absolutely no idea what the last clip was that you have watched but I'm about to edit this vlog and I realised that I haven't ended it. Um, I literally did not pick up the camera yesterday. I had a day off. We went into town. I went into Kiehl's to get like a skin assessment. You can head over to my Instagram or my TikTok to have a look at that. I did like a little reel for that. Um, which was fun. But other than that, we literally just had some lunch and then... On the way home we got a Christmas tree, which is a whole other topic. Um, and yeah, just came home, chilled, 
and unfortunately went back to work this morning. So um, that's that. But I'm going to end the vlog here. I need to edit it for you and upload it. I'm not sure what day. But I hope you're doing really well. And I will see you all in my next one.